Hi friends, Sheila Lanier here with Homework Remodels and Twilight Builders. Day 14 of our Remodel Chronicle of our home. <sighs> Today, we had a new experience. Don't know where this came up or why I wasn't prepared, but I need to share. So, it's about being able to store your things while you're remodeling and find them if something comes up. Who knew? So my husband, Fred, went to the store to pick up a couple of things, not a huge deal, and he ended up locking his keys in the car. <laughs> I don't carry a spare key for his vehicle with me, and I was away at work. <laughs> so then we had to try to find his spare key. Well, it's in a plastic Ziploc bag with all of our other spare keys hidden, <laughs> effectively hidden somewhere in our house. So, obviously, I did not have a plan for that. I was not expecting that to be a challenge or an issue. I think at some point in time I went, oh yeah, these will be safe here. <laughs> and I totally forgot where that was. So I haven't looked for them in, you know, two and a half weeks. And I haven't thought about them two and a half weeks. And of all the things that you never think about with the things that go into remodeling, it's storing stuff that you may or may not need, when you may or may not need it, to be able to find it. I just floored, just floored. So I know that some of you out there are very organized and would totally have that under control and dialed in. I did not. And I would encourage <laughs> for those things that are important, don't just put them away yourself. Maybe share that information with somebody else whom is close to you, a family member, a friend, your spouse, just maybe. <laughs> anyway, Remodel Chronicle, day 14. We lost <laughs> the spare keys. <laughs> oh, take great care of yourself. You are the best you you've got.